Very well. So my Antminer E9 Pro has been mining for two hours and 23 minutes. And um, uh, all systems se seem to be working fine. Uh, the real time hash rate is normal. The network status is normal. Fan speed and minor temperature, everything seems normal. Um, it takes, it takes uh, Antminer, um, it's, it, the instructions say that it takes a few minutes for the statistics starts to show, but it takes more than that. I had to uh, let, it, let it work for, for a while for the statistics to start to show. The, the average total hash rate is 3,903 mega hashes per second. Um, so it's a very powerful miner. And um, this is the chain rate, mega, mega hashes per, per second. I don't know what this, what this stat means, chain zero, chain one. Uh, it must mean that uh, the, the ASIC miner is, is, is working fine. Bueno, here the, um, the mining pools that I set up for and pool, they have three addresses where you point your miner. Um, ETC POW.11 is the name of this miner. ETC proof of work or POW is my, my username in Ant Miner in the mining pool. And uh, the number 11 is the number of this machine in particular. So this same machine is um, pointing to three uh, pools. And I think that it works for the first one first and if, if it disconnects or something, it works for the second one and then the third one, something like that. Um, here you can see that it's been working mainly for the first one. Um, the 7,273 uh, works have been sent uh, or accepted and uh, 61 rejected. So there were, there were more sent and uh, others rejected. So well, this, this is all data and stats for, for geek miners. Uh, these, are, these are the stats of the hardware itself. Number of chips that it has, hash board. So it must have two hash boards. And this is, these two together must be this this total hash rate. So yeah, it has two boards, not one. This must be why it needs so much uh, fans. Um, more stats here. As, as shown in the previous video, the, 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 these are the settings. Now the, the fan started on, it, it starts on and off. It starts on and off every now and then, the, the big fans. Uh, I hope you can hear me. And uh, when I go to Antpool, the account that I set up is receiving the hash rate. Uh, it has a worker identified, which is worker 11, which is my machine, under my account, etc. POW. So this is the, this is the, the worker stat. And when I go to the dashboard, the dashboard is to see several workers, really. So you see the same chart. <coughs> And um, I see my account balance in, in ETC. I'm starting to earn uh, money already. Uh, and it has some, some stats here. And I have, one, I have one active machine for now. So these are, these are this is to show that uh, after two hours and 20 something minutes, both on Antpool and on, on the Antminer dashboard, everything is working fine so in conclusion here is my screen on my computer with the dashboard of the ant miner showing how it's mining i'm going to move to see the dashboard on Antpool. there you can see that it's mining um, this is the Antpool dashboard um, the overview shows how much I am earning there and the ant miner you see that the light the green light is 
linking, that means that it's working, it's sending hashes to the pool, and everything is working fine, the paths are working fine, and everything is set up on my router, my miner connected to the super transformer and wall, and both the ant miner dashboard. Uh, on ant pool and the ant miner dashboard itself are working fine thank you for watching this series of videos uh, showing how to mine ethereum classic using the ant miner e9 pro asic machine uh, mining on ant pool goodbye